Okay, so I've already poured the bottle, and you can clearly see there's a lot more head on the can. Now, granted, I did come in at a worse angle. It does work better to open the bottle when you have a separate hand. So I'm going to let this go. I, I'm not the one to pour right. Just bear with me. Okay, now if I really was properly equipped, I'd come over with the blade and chink, just do, do like that. Now I don't have the blade. I do run with the proper glasses. You see I have the two different sizes. Yeah, sorry, this is home stuff. Didn't quite blur all that out, but basically I'm going to take a sniff here. Okay, it smells like Stella. I know my Stella. Then over here, it smells like Stella, but I tell you guys, what comes out of the can is so much smoother. So much of a better taste. I love Stella. Honestly, talk to any bartender. They're not going to like Stella because of the, the papering on the bottle. But you know what? It's still a great beer. Almost globally available. If not, yes, globally available. And I'm convinced that the, uh, the, the can actually is the magic here. And I've always kind of preferred doing my beer in bottles. But let's take a look inside of this can because I'm convinced there's technology in here. So the can, um, you know, it's not just, I'm convinced there's a liner here that is making it easy for us. In the uh, other beers I like, I've had, uh, I like a lot of beers, but I'm particularly fond of the Belgians, right? So I've got Blanche de Bruxelles, another Belgian beer. I really like that one. They have a great can technology. Now that's a different can. Okay, that is a 50 centiliter on the B2B, but Stella is a 440. Let's take a look and see what's going on. I'm convinced that, let's see if I can do this, put this down for just a second, whenever the knife comes out, two hands would be a good idea, well if we look in there, the camera can't quite see it, there's not really that much of a technology going in there, but I'm just convinced that this can, whatever it's doing, it delivers Stella much better, and I'm convinced that this Stella will taste just as good as the uh, draft Stella, if not better. Now, those of you who know your beer, and especially Stella, the way it foams, just look at that. You can tell me right away you don't notice a difference. Bought them both from the same store, presumably the same distributor here in the States. Um, you know, the way they roll, I was looking to see if I recognize it, but I don't. Um, and it's pretty much, yeah, it's the same on the bottom. So how they distribute it here in the States is pretty uh, straightforward, right? but it's going to come from the same place. So if you're a Stella fan, I really encourage you to check out Stella in the chalice can. All right, Rickatron out.